What's good, music producers? Curtis King of Curtis King TV, and I am in excruciating pain getting over this molar surgery, but we're gonna make it through here because our friends at Mixed and Key invited me to try out Captain Plugins, and I can't wait to show you how powerful this thing is. Bear with me. I'm still very new to it, so I'm sure there's some features that I'm not perfect at, and we'll talk about all that and more in just a second. Let's talk about it. Okay, music producers, I had no idea the capabilities of all of these different parts of Captain plugins, including Captain Chords, Captain Beat, Captain Deep, Captain Melody, Captain Play. Who is Captain Chords for? Folks like me. <laughs> Those that don't really have too much music theory knowledge and you're more visual learners and you want to see exactly what you're playing, this is like one of the best plugins that you could have for that. Let me go ahead and select a key. Let's go to the key of D and let's go to the harmonic minor. Click go. You don't have to have this every time you open it up, but it is a great little tool to get you started. And from here, it's already giving me a chord in D minor. Let's go ahead and just kind of take a little quick tour. Here, you determine your key that you want to mess around with like we did earlier, the scale. Here, you have different types of progressions. So if I click on here, it'll generate progressions for me right here. And I can manipulate any of those manually or by using some of their timings right here. Here I can change the rhythm in which it's played. You can even click on here and access all of these presets that allow you to play it in so many different ways. And as you can see here, I can manipulate individual sounds by just dragging it. It's almost really like the piano roll in FL Studio. And I can double click, add another note. They won't allow you <laughs> to play the wrong key. So even if you don't know what you're doing, you literally can come here, drag it anywhere you want. They're gonna readjust all the other chords so it makes sense. This is super crazy. That's nuts. Now, from the research that I've done, they've made some great updates to five that really justify picking it up. For instance, being what I just showed you, how you can just click on it, double click and it'll delete it. And then also I can grab the cord and shorten it as I want. Hold down shift and then duplicate it however I want to from there. So it's really just like the piano roll in FL Studio, but everything is internal. Here you can determine the space that is in between each chord. You could change the strumming, you can change the swing, which you know I'm obsessed with. I'm all off beat today. <laughs> My tooth is killing me, fam. I think the new standard for these type of plugins is that they come with so much more than just what they offer. Look at all these sounds that you already have access to. Now you may be saying, well, Curtis, I already got my own sounds and these sound cool, they sound dope, but I have my sounds. Fair enough. If you click OK and come over here to plugins, click here. I had to run a search earlier to get all access to these, but if you already have your plugins installed, you literally can bring in whatever plugin it recognizes within here without having to do the send output situation. You don't have to do any MIDI sends. You literally can do everything internally within Captain Chords, which I think is super dope. Let me go ahead and grab one of my favorite VSTs, Mini Monster. Boom. Click off of here, and now it's going to play these chord progressions with my actual VST. <laughs> you can access it right here. Super dope, right? From here, I can go to any individual set of chords and then add variations by going up here. So I can do variations of this one key or do variations of chords that are in that particular scale. Now, this mode that I've been editing in is the verse mode. You may be asking, well, how can I pencil these in myself according to the key and scale that I chose? If you click on play here, you can hit the MIDI keyboard or the computer keyboard option, and it allows you to basically trigger your sounds either using your keyboard here from your computer or your MIDI keyboard. I want to use the MIDI keyboard. This is what I'm used to. I'm going to drag this octave to the third, this octave to the second, 
And I just want to show you how ridiculous it is. I can play any key, my friends, and it'll all be in key, which is crazy. I'm going a half notes up and it's still in, it's still in key. I can't do any wrong. So this is like that blew my mind. And once I press play or the space bar, it's going to automatically start recording whatever I put in there. Now we can go here to the edit option and put that right back in the verse mode that we were editing earlier. Here I can see exactly what I played and I can manipulate things to see if I can get like some interesting variations. Let's see what that does if I bring it up a couple keys. Ugh, that's not bad. Now that we have that, let's open up another one of the Captain plugins that works in perfect harmony with this Captain D. Some of us struggle with bass lines. Not anymore. If you click connect, it'll basically connect to whatever you played in Captain chords. They're all working in harmony now. So if I play this, it's going to play it. Let's actually click here on the rhythm and get it on every beat. <laughs> Baseline done, fam. Baseline done, if I want it to be done. Once again, like the other one, it comes with its own plugins. Got 808s. Stop it. Stop it, fam. Actually, you know what? You know what I want to do? I want to choose my own VST. Hmm. I think I'll do that. Let's let's go ahead and go open up Trillion. Find my favorite baseline. Change the octave because it's kind of muddy in that octave. Ugh. So it's just generating these things and I haven't even committed anything to my actual die yet. Okay, let's open up another plugin from the Captain plugin family. Let's go here. Since I'm already starting to beatbox, let's actually get Captain beaten here which allows you to basically generate drum loops that you literally having to do no work right now, but at least gives you some inspiration as you build these things out and get a vision of what this track could be. So that's a four to the four. Let's take the metronome off and let's go here to the patterns. As you can see, mixed in key gives you some amazing banks that you can choose from. Click on it. It'll automatically readjust all your drums to it. You can even import your own banks in here if you wanted to. Uh, I see the homie Eldre's in here. Let's go ahead and see what he got in terms of hip hop and where are we at 86. Let's try some of these BPMs. <laughs> Something else that's really dope is that if I go over here, I can literally take drums and add them in here. Super dope feature. If I'm done with this, I can go over here to the export. If I want to export this, I have the option of exporting this individual channel, either in audio or MIDI or the entire thing that's put here together in master audio or master MIDI. Let's take master audio and let's just have it there if you want to. Boom, dragged it, it's done. All right, to bring everything home, let's go ahead and use Captain Play. Now I was gonna show you Captain Melody. It's pretty self-explanatory what this does, but I think that Captain Play is gonna give you a better idea of how you can utilize their Melody system. So I'm gonna go ahead and press go and we're gonna use this to basically play melodies in MIDI. So I'm going to go ahead and choose. So now <laughs> this is the part that really brings everything home. We got it in the right key, the right scale. It will not allow me to do any wrong. <laughs> I'm in here playing like I know what I'm doing and I don't know what lick of this music theory, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm in here playing, playing. 
And if I wanted, I could just drag all of that solo stuff that I just played into its individual channel. Look, y'all outdone yourself, Captain. All right, all right, Captain there. All right there, Captain. Mixed and key family. Shout out to the programmers and the folks that put this together. This is an amazing, amazing plugin. And I'm honored that you gave me the opportunity to talk about it. Now, producers, if you want to get any of these and you want to get a discount, use my name at the checkout. I don't mean hit nobody up. I mean, use my actual name as a coupon code. It'll give you a discount. If you want to know how to access these plugins, go to the description below. It'll have the coupon code there and you'll get all the information that you need in order to get your hands on this. Y'all about to see me go off in these live streams. So I greatly appreciate Mixed and Key for reaching out and allowing me to go ahead and display this for you. If you enjoyed this video, definitely hit that button that go like this, that like button. Share this with somebody you know that can benefit from this. And like I always say in this life, you will not be full of life until you decide to live life to its fullest. This is Curtis King of slapexperts.com. Have a good one. Look up, Nazi. Say cheese. Hmm. <gasps>